Do you want to know how to wire up a tortoise switch? Well, that's coming up right now. Okay, please excuse the crudeness of this. I tried to mimic the diagram I found online as closely as I could to show you how I wired up my tortoise switches. I'll post in this video the diagram that I found so you can see exactly how I did this. I have a turnout here, my tortoise switch, my bicolor LED, and my double pole double throw. I looked online and I found a lot of videos how to hook up the turnout to the tortoise switch but not so many going from the tortoise switch to the LED. So I did find this diagram and I went off of it and it works great. I'm going to show you in this video how I hooked everything up. I found a good video from the DCC guy which I'll link in this video how to wire these um, wires to the tortoise switch. You basically go from underneath through the hole and bend over the wires and solder them to each tab here. That's exactly how I did these. It works out great and it's nice and solid. I went from each terminal here straight down to the terminal block I have. So each one is exactly how it is wired here. It's hard to see in this jumbled mess. And then we'll be able to go from here out to each section. The good part about doing this is if your tortoise switch ever goes bad, all you do is unhook these, throw your new tortoise switch in, and you don't have to rewire anything else. So now we'll get into how you wire each piece of this. These two are your power lines for your tortoise switch, and then there's switches inside this. There's two of them. So one, two, and three these two are each side of the switch and this is your common part of the switch so this side has one and this side has another so you have your common and your two sides of your switch this half is for your led and this half is for your turnout so what i did was the, this line and this wire so this is my brown and this is my orange they go over to the brown and orange on my double pole double throw. And then from here, these two, the blue, the white white blue and the blue blue, go to my power. So I have a five volt bus power um, system underneath my layout. So this goes to my five volt bus and these go to my each side of the tortoise switch. And this is a standard double pull double throw, standard wiring for that. After that's hooked up, I take, this is my bicolor LED, green and red. So I have my green and my red here, and this is my common. I have a 470 resistor hooked up to this. So this goes to my... Whoa, 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 pause, pause, pause. I don't feel like I was explaining that well enough. So we have our tortoise switch here, and we have our three wires that go to our LED. The two go directly to the LED, the green and red, and the third one, which I'm calling the common, will go straight to your 5 volt power system. In addition to that, your LED, you have your green and red wire, then also the middle, which I'm also calling the common, will go directly to your 5 volt power system. And through that, they'll be powered and working together. So I just wanted to try to make that clear, and hopefully that's clear as mud now to you. So let's get back to the show. So you have to hook up the green and the brown both to a power system, so your 5 volt power. Next, I will just hook up my red and my green here, my red and green, go to there. Next, we'll look at the turnout. We have the frog wire going from here into the common part of the switch inside the tortoise. And then we have the right rail and left rail. So the right rail comes around and goes into, you'll have to solder a wire onto the right side. And your left rail goes over and connects to your left rail there. 
these do not provide power to your turnouts so you'll have to have wires here going to your bus so these are connected to my bus providing power up here this just switches the polarity inside the switch which comes from here so you have to go each side of here your common for your frog and it'll switch perfectly so I'll just switch it here now obviously this is not hooked up to here but it would be moving that back and forth and everything will be merry so I hope you learned something here I hope I made some sense of it and if you have any questions please comment down below thank you and have a great day remember it makes sense if you don't think about it